Alright people, it's Sprat here, and today we're going to start things off with some leftover clips, some, yeah, split clips from recently. Not Nothing too crazy, honestly, nothing too crazy. Just some Modern Warfare Remastered gameplay with the Barrett, with the M40 as well in there. And then I think I'm going to follow that with two really nice streaks from two different games. One is with the R700 on Bog, who'd have guessed it? And uh, then we've got one with the M40 on Backlot, just like a 15-odd streak on both of those, I think. Something like that. So, hope you enjoy that. I think I'm going to follow up with some longbow gameplay as well from Infinite Warfare because I have, like I said in the last one I did, last video like this, the last commentary I did, I have some Infinite Warfare gameplay just sat there right now and by the time I want to do a commentary and talk about some stuff, it seems that I don't have enough remaster gameplay. So we're going to merge it again, but I've been I've been kind of focusing on 2 and 2 right now with my videos. 2 remastered, then 2 Infinite Warfare, and I think it's going pretty well. I think you enjoy the variety and obviously that's what I'm going for here, so hope you all enjoy. Please give a like if you do, I'd really appreciate it. I was going to do like a live video today, but Honestly, I've just been on remastered trying to grind the camo challenges I always try to do the R700 a lot yesterday and doing some more today doing the ACOG Making sure I get gold before I prestige because right now I'm only prestige 1 level 54 I think if you don't play this game a lot it sounds like a lot, but it's not compared to a lot of other people right now So I'm just catching up and then once I prestige I'll probably do M21 dragon off videos stuff like that But that's what I was doing today. So I really didn't get anything too exciting uh, And that's why I decided to do this video just talk about some stuff that's on my mind and show off some gameplay and it's always nice to do these it's always nice to just sit down and chat about some things that's on my mind so we're getting to that soon and i know you guys are thinking why don't you just do a road to regal video or something like that i, I don't want to do two road twos at the same time i'm enjoying road to diamond and i think if i do another road two especially when it's the same series just on a different game the, it, the aim of the game or the aim of the series is to get the best camo i can get on the sniper without obviously dark matter or whatever it is on both of these games but I don't want to do another Road to Camo Challenge. If I was going to do another Road to, it would be like Road to a Clip or Road to a Kill Cam. I know people want some random trick shot videos uh, here and there, whatever. So, don't really want to do two Camo series like that at a time. But maybe I'll do Regal. Maybe I'll do Road to Regal after. I'm not too, I'm not really too sure. I think the hype is kind of lost already with that. But we'll, uh, we'll see how I'm feeling once I'm done with Road to Diamonds. So, I also get many tweets, many comments on the daily about a sniping tips video. When are you going to do one on this game, on Remastered, on Infinite Warfare. I love the Black Ops 3 one, and I, w I want to thank you guys as well for that. If you checked out the Black Ops 3 How to Snipe video that was on Phase last year, that is on like 1.3 million views, something like that, which is absolutely disgusting. Honestly, so many people click that video, and I'm really happy with that video. I, I put so much time into it, so much thought. I just tried to cover everything I could, and the reason I did that video, and the reason I think that video did w so well was because of how different Sniper was on that game. It was such a weird thing to grasp, a weird concept to grasp, because it was just like... You had no target assist on the majority of the snipers, and at the time, that was so new to uh, Call of Duty. Every time, I mean, on console, obviously, every time you sniped, you had aim assist, target assist, whatever you want to call it, and on that game, you didn't. And that's why that video did so well, and that's why I wanted to make that video, because I had so many tips and stuff like that to talk about because I know people are going to say well Infinite Warfare is a similar game It's you know, it's got movement and stuff like that. That wasn't really the main point of the video I mean obviously I gave tips on working around the movement and how to counter people's movement on that game But the reason that sniping on that game was so weird was one the target assist and two when you scope down Your sensitivity never changed if you were on a 10 sensitivity and you scope down on a guy You're still rocking 10 sensitivity and on this game and on remastered on Infinite Warfare whatever on is on the screen right now the scoping sensitivity is different to your outside obviously you can't change it but you can rock a higher sensitivity to counteract the slow down scope if that makes sense so the reason i did a tips video on black ops 3 was because of how weird that was but on infinite warfare and remastered the old classic sniping still makes sense it's still there and there's not really many tips i can give that haven't already been said, and even the Black Ops 3 ones will probably still make sense. It's just like the old games right now, and I know the intervention apparently doesn't have target assist when you get it on Infinite Warfare, which I don't know why they keep doing stuff like that, like, oh, we'll give a couple of snipers aim assist, and then we'll take it off on this one, but then we'll put it on the next two. Like, why? why? You either just have it, or you don't have it. Like, just make up your mind. So, I know it's going to be a little bit weird, but even then, it just doesn't make sense to really do, like, a high, intense, well thought out tips video because it's just how it has been in the past and so many years of Call of Duty. Even with the no target assist intervention, 
you're going to be rocking a high sensitivity. It's going to slow down in your scope. And yeah, you might not have a pull there, but you've got a slower in scope sensitivity, if that makes any sense. So that's the reason I haven't really done a sniping tips video. I just wanted to cover that. Maybe I'll do just a simple one, just talking about the basics. Uh, if you want that, let me know. I'd really appreciate it. But I think for the majority, there's not really too much to cover because it's like the eight cards before. Uh, Black Ops 3 you were. So I want to talk about one more thing before I let you guys go here and that's because I need some help. I need some ideas. I need some advice on what I want to do on this Sunday. So this Sunday is going to be a, a weird day because we haven't really ever done this and it's me and the grind squad. Just some people in face, some people in red, some people in no teams, just people who make videos and, and go for clips and stuff like that. We make videos together and we play together, we make montages, all that good stuff. And we've kind of been slacking since the new cards have come out. We've really been slacking on playing together and I kind of want to blame the divide of two cards, to, honestly, because we never are on the same game at the same time. Like with me, I play two and two, so I'll two days of remastered and two days of infinite warfare. So when I'm on infinite warfare, it seems like everyone's on remastered and when everyone's on infinite warfare it feels like i'm on remastered so the idea there is just weird and with remastered as well when we play together it's really hard for like me and testy they're in america and the lobbies have just been re really really weird and the lobbies never fill when you're playing a party on that game it's just a bad experience but we've been slacking on making videos so we're organizing a full day literally a full day we've never done this we've had like nights where we made videos together but we're scheduling a full day to make so many videos it's going to be absolutely disgusting but we're literally going to spend a full day together on like 3v3s like s d uh free for all whatever it may be so i need comments right now i need ideas on what you want to see because it's a new cards so we got fresh ideas and i want to see what you want from me and the grind squad it's probably going to be a full six so we can do multiplayer we can do private matches we can do whatever you want so let me know in the comments right now what you want to see some may go up on my channel some may go up on the other guys channel but overall we're spending a full day on making tons of videos so we're going to be set for the near future and then we'll just plan another day again and obviously we'll go back to playing and making montages and doing highlight videos stuff like that but for that day we want special videos to be made so if you have any ideas let me know in the comments but I think that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay, the streaks, all that good stuff. It always is nice to just sit down and talk to you guys and show off some gameplay. So, hope you enjoyed that today. Probably Infinite Warfare tomorrow. I don't know. Maybe I'll merge some highlights. I really don't know. I haven't really been getting much, honestly, recently. I've just been all over the place. But we'll see what we can do. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.